Remember, it takes more courage to come forward and report than it does to stay silent. Hello, uh, I'm Roy Green, uh, 77th Brigade Victims Advocate. Uh, spent 30 plus years in the uh, Western New Army National Guard, primarily uh, with the 150th. Hello, One Guard family. My name is Greg Oscar. I'm the 77th Brigade SARC. I want to take a minute to talk to you about the importance of men in the SAPR program. Sometimes it's hard for a man to come forward and talk about things that might have happened to them. And I just want you to know that you're not alone. We're here to help you and we need you to come forward if something happens. My counterpart and I, uh, Mr. Oscar, as we come on board as part of the uh, SAPR program, feel like it's, it's a very vital step, very necessary step to have men enter this field. Um, it provides a, a more viable outlet for men of sexual assault. Nobody ever thinks about or likes to talk about men being victims of sexual assault. However, men are victims of sexual assault. Having men victims advocates and men SARCs in those roles hopefully will help ease the burden of coming forward and reporting such crimes and um, it's not easy for a man to admit that he was violated, he was taken advantage of. Generally men don't come forward because it feel, they feel that it has taken something away from their manhood. Their stereotypes, their friends might uh, look at him differently because they came forward and, and generally men tend to not be victims of sexual assault in their minds, but in reality, it does happen to men as well. I feel these programs are, are vitally important. Uh, one, no victim should have to face anything alone. Uh, we're, we're fortunate that the leadership of the West Virginia Army National Guard has take a, taken a viable interest, vested interest in helping our soldiers and airmen recover. So it's not easy for victims, whether it be a man or a woman, to come forward uh, and admit that they were violated, they were assaulted, they were harmed, they were wronged. Uh, something as personal and intimate as a sexual assault, it takes a lot of courage to come forward. If anybody wants to come forward, they can reach out to myself or my counterparts. Uh, we have uh, people that work at the Glen Jean Armory at the 77th Brigade. Our offices are there, or you can call me on my cell phone at 304-541-8813 and everything that you talk to me about is confidential. Let it be known that the Victims Advocates and uh, SARCs that are currently with the program stand by 24-7 to take your calls, field your questions, or allow you to file complaints uh, of sexual assault. Uh, all of our services are confidential. Uh, should you desire information, we can explore the different reporting options versus whether it be a restricted or unrestricted report and allow you to determine what best course of action will help you on your road to recovery. Be strong, step up, report.